Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Dailyish Vlogs with Gamba. I know, I know, I'm a little bit late, I'm sorry, but I don't even have a good excuse why I was so, uh, late. I just needed some time off the internet, which I just spent on the internet. Well, well, I'm not very smart, I guess. This episode will just be because, especially because it was... Uh, kind of ordered by Michael and other people as well. I think CMD wanted one as well. It's kind of spontaneous because of that and I just want to I just want to apologize for uh, the chaos I will cause during during this vlog. So the idea is basically to sit and talk about stuff and um, some people love it, some people will hate it. Um, I'm sorry for those who hate it, but I, I swear to God, I have I have stuff for you prepared. I just need to cut it. I need more time, um, which will be very hard this week because I have some appointments to actually to do. One or two will be very, very important for me. Maybe not for you this much. A little bit for you as well, but uh, a little bit more for me. So, yes, what have I been up to in the last few days. I was uh, reading a lot actually. I bought a new book, um, this one here. It's about psychopaths. Oh, I just see that I have one. Th I have this book by the author is Thomas Ericsson. I think he's a Swede from Sweden. He's from Sweden. And I actually have Surrounded by Narcissists <laughs> as well by this man, Thomas Ericsson, as you can see here. Uh, I just didn't I just didn't realize. Yeah, and one is in German, one is in English. Very, very well done, Gumbo, well done. <laughs> so, yeah, I was reading a lot. I don't know, I just uh, found out that I... that this topic about psychopath is kind of interesting. I think this is because, uh, you know, I, I have this once in a while. Uh, I think this happens because it's now dark and it's spooky time, so I'm like... Oh, I need a, I need a story, right? <laughs> like, searching the internet for like creepy stuff, and uh, I don't know. By the way, how how do you like the lighting? Uh, I hope it's not too. I hope I hope it's not too much lighting. And uh, I thought that I would show you the books, but then I thought, no, I did this already on a stream, so I have many books lying around here, and <laughs> basically basically threw this uh, idea out of the window again. So, mm, the rest was basically I was chilling. I had I had an episode uh, made uh, ready already as well. After right after my birthday, mm, which is also a few days ago now, but the problem was I was not very well that day, so <laughs> it was not a good idea to upload this. I didn't even look very fit and not not don't get me wrong not because I drank something uh, alcoholic this day uh, on my birthday but uh, which was basically just one glass uh, to you know to salute with my family but it was more of an I was just exhausted man we were walking around the whole day through the city and what <laughs> was just exhausting so it was a little bit yeah, I was just I was just dead inside, which makes sense, right? Um, full day. First, my sister. We met with my sister. We went to this uh, mini golf. It was kind of kind of interesting because it was like dark light, black light. I I don't know how you say this in English. And the motifs on the walls were like movies or scenes out of movies, and you had to guess also the movies. But yeah, this was kind of nice. Then we went uh, into a restaurant with my sister and later the day uh, we met my parents in the city and went to another restaurant. So we were basically walking, eating, having a little bit of fun, one drinksy and that was it. And I was dead, <laughs> basically. So yeah, that was my birthday. And after that I was just relaxing, right, because I 
as I said, this week, especially the week out, right after my birthday, it started with like appointments and calls and everything. And it was, it's a little bit exhausting. I think it's also the, the dark time that it's, you know, it's, it's, night se it's, it's now 7 p.m. And uh, I'm already, it's already dark outside. So, and it's already dark for an hour. So, you know what <laughs> this means. The body is shutting down. Normally, I don't have problems with... Um, the thing is, normally, I, I'm a very energetic person. I don't have problems with energy or being exhausted. But the last week was kind of exhausting. I, I don't know why. I even... The thing is... I hate it so much when I try to, for example, I'm doing something here on the computer. I have a couch over there. You know, I just think like, oh yeah, come, let's let's do this. I don't know, power nap for 30, sec uh, for 30 seconds, 30 minutes. I lay down, start listening to music, and then I'm laying there for 10 minutes. And then I'm like, okay, not, not, not this tired actually. So I'm standing up and doing stuff again. <laughs> What is this? I don't I don't even know. I hate it. It's like first your your body tells you, "Oh yeah, you have to lay down, shut down, relax a little bit." Then after 10 minutes of listening to music and not being completely able to fall asleep, I tried everything. I tried a warm bath, uh, you know, everything basically. Nothing works. I don't know what it is. I was in the city in the meantime as well because of course, where when you have appointments, you have to go to the city. And finally, I bought, finally after, I mean, you know when the Greek vlog was, right? When when I was on the Greek vacation. Um, since then, I've lost my sunglasses. I just went into the waves. I mean, it was not even, it was not even this deep. I was like to my knees maybe, but there came a really huge wave. And then, you know, I had my sunglasses on because it was subscription. Uh, with subscription glasses, so I had to, <laughs> you know, I, I had to wear them to actually see something. <laughs> so the wave came from behind and basically took my glasses like psst, to the front and I, I've never seen them again. It was, can you imagine the pain? It was like the, we were 10 days in Greece and like on the second or the third day, it was very in the very beginning of this uh, vacation. It just, it just took my sunglasses away. And then you have to walk around in the sunlight. It was so bright <laughs> with these glasses. No, it, it, I, I couldn't. It was annoying as hell. I, I just bought like, uh, you know, replicates of Ray-Ban shades <laughs> where I could see nothing. I mean, I basically could see nothing with these shades because no prescription glasses, right? This is why I was talking about um, Pose Poseidon and and Hades because um, as we were in Greece, right? Poseidon took my glasses away. <laughs> he took them as a payment, I guess, for something. I don't know. Maybe, maybe in the future I will uh, I will be um, longer in Greece because I really really liked it there. Yeah, and why why Hades and Poseidon? First of all, they are brothers. To, together with Zeus, they are three brothers. Kronos is uh, Kronos is the father, and there is um, I don't know if you know the thing is first thing I'm not really good in Greece mythology, but I know that uh, at some point in the earlier um, times there was a cult who. Worship, worshipped Poseidon as the god of death. This is why people think that Hades and Poseidon actually have switched roles, uh, which could be possible. It actually makes pretty much sense that uh, Poseidon could be the god of death as well, because, um, as you know, Greece has many, many, many little islands, right? So, um, going by boat from one to the other in stormy days could mean death as well. So I, I assume that he is a little bit of both. He's the god of the sea and uh, the god of death because the sea can take lives as well. So yeah, finally I have new glasses. I ordered them. And this is basically this is basically it. I This week was 
a little bit turbulent, but at the same time it was um, not really turbulent. I, I don't know how to describe it. It was really kind of strange. And um, yeah, I hope that I can start streaming soon again. Um, I I took this in, this weekend off because I need to actually to... I will have appointments. I will have appointments this week as well. Uh, today is Monday, by the way. And um, there will be definitely this week a little bit to do for me. So I don't know if I can and when I can stream. Uh, but definitely on the weekend. This weekend will be a stream. Or two, maybe even. Thank you for watching. Leave a like and subscribe as always. And um, see you in the next one, daily vlog. The thing is, um, and by the way, Michael, uh, I don't know what my password for the other account is. So there will be definitely the first few videos on this channel. And I try to restore the other channel's password somehow. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe as I said. And uh, see you soon. Gambao. Ciao.